there is one more project I want to do on the van before we head out on our trip. It's been uh, kind of percolating in my brain for a while. The inspiration actually comes from two people. The first one is Doug. And what he did, oh, he sent me the pictures of the what he did, which was to put hinges on this door that covers all the stuff, when, like when you want to winterize, all these things in here you got to turn. Uh, and he put hinges on there so it was easy to open because right now it's just uh, screws and it's a little bit of a pain. And then the other inspiration came from Larry, who in his, uh, he has a, that what he has. He has a pleasure way something or other. But he put a, like a box behind his door. I just routered a handhold on the back. Wow. I need to find somebody to do that for me. <laughs> Drawer. That is a great idea. That is such a great idea. But when I opened up this opening, I realized that I can't do that because I got pipes that don't give me enough room to have any depth at all in, a, in any kind of a cupboard there. So I thought, how could I make this something that actually locks? So I went online and started Googling locks and found this. This is an RFID lock. And I have convinced my neighbor to help me do this project. And he has already found a piece of one by two that actually <laughs> didn't even cut it. He just brought it this over and it fit perfectly in here. So that's going to get glued in here like that. And then the hinges will go on here and here. The R, then I have another piece of scrap wood that I found in the garage and this RFID lock will then sit down here somewhere and you open it. It's only 20 bucks, by the way. You open it with a, a fob of some sort or a card and it will go through one and three quarter inches thickness and you just hold it on here and it comes off and you can actually install this thing in two different directions there's a hole here and there's a hole here uh, my neighbor even had the hinges <laughs> boy do I have the greatest neighbors perfect perfect Don told me it was supposed to get to 93 degrees today it's already 94 and Bruce says it's going to 97 <laughs> Like that. So you can put a screw, one screw right there, one screw here, and one and then, screw right in the middle. Oh, that's really hard. <laughs> it's really hard. You sure? Uh, oh, I better put my glasses on. <laughs> yes, so us old people need glasses. Yeah. And it's not very sharp. Well, this is really hard for Micah. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Okay. So make sure you don't have a bit too long that comes in and hit this hits the pipe. Because Bruce said I almost did. She almost, almost dinged it. Did. Okay, here's this. That's the blue side. Yep. Okay. I'm gonna get up off my back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got better clamps than that. Oh my god, we're comparing clamps now? <laughs> So we're gonna go get a countersink. There we go. Bruce says, make sure you go straight. You tell me if I'm straight. It's looking straight. Okay. Don't be afraid of it. Okay. Don't be afraid to destroy your cabinets. Well, you're burning it. <laughs> <laughs> I, think, I think that's good. That's gonna work. So go a little bit more on my side this time. Okay. Because you got it warbled to that side. Downtown. Now wait, 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 wait. Yeah, that's so why we, you move the clamp. So we move the clamp up so we can really, this screw really has a bite on it. Wait a minute. I changed my mind. I was gonna put those blocks down here, like that, and have it here. And I decided that I would put it up here so this is gonna go like this 
and this gets screwed to the back of the door and then this piece this piece here goes into this block of wood now we got our two pieces of wood up there what's next bruce well i think we're going to try to put some hinges on okay turns out we don't have the right hinges and it's too hot today anyway so we are going to get the right hinges and then pick it up in a few days okay guys this is bruce hi <laughs> he's welcome. my savior welcome to our world yes new tool awesome this is a wow. craig concealed hinge kit i had one job to do which was to get the hinges and i forgot so off to home depot nice wow. wrong hinges again so back to home depot so close to that screw is that going to be a problem only if it hits <laughs> <laughs> go around like this to get that corner okay they get a line look yeah. at that isn't that beautiful <laughs> no but we'll see if that works okay uh, did you hear john you owe bruce big time <laughs> you owe him big time <laughs> i think i'll have been in the neighborhood ought to see what i have to deal with that's right <laughs> We're learning just to shut up. In the supermarket, you hear this all the time. Pick up on Isle Debbie. So after we finished, I discovered there is a template in here. So that would have made the job a little bit easier. But now you guys know if you want to take this on. Big of a... Get that, get it? Yep. You know, you might as well buy the smallest jar of glue you can find because these things always dry out, don't they? Yeah. Thanks to Bruce. Thanks to the best neighbor ever. No, you, it's, you know, I, I like this. It's, I thought you we'll did get started job. working on your, what kind of car you have? Start working on your the one in your oh, garage. Oh, the sixty-three and a half Ranchero. Yes, yes. Witness. Yeah, that that'll be a that'll be primo. It is. How's the interior? Oh, it's in awesome. good shape. Yeah, the, the interior is great. Yeah. Wow. This is the year wow. they came out with a V eight. Oh, this is a so this is a V eight. V eight, and it's a four speed. Run. 